We all know that Paytm IPO was priced at 2150 per share. While IPO investors are very upset, let me tell you that few PE and VC funds like Saif and Elevation Capital have got between 28 to 140 times of their investment value. Similar thing happened with the Nike IPO. TPG, Lighthouse and others made substantial returns. Hi, this is Sridhar Ramachandran. In this video, let's find out the expectation of PE funds if you are wanting one. Buy to sell is the motto of private equity funds. Typically, these funds scout around for a value buy, create short to medium term value and sell their stake with higher returns and move on to another opportunity. This may sound simple, but not really until you understand what they do. Typically, a PE fund have a corpus of 500 crores with a tenor of 5 years. They look to invest in say 10 companies. To get a net IRR of 25% after their expenses, they must get an exit value of 1200 crores, which is 2.4 times. It is not possible that all 10 companies would perform evenly to get this type of return. Few of them would underperform, some of them normal and couple of them would outperform. It's a high risk investment and the portfolio managers are always under pressure to get average return from their investments. So what exactly they do to achieve their goals? First is effective deal sourcing. If a fund wants to invest in 10 companies, they normally evaluate at least 60 to 100 companies. So much of work goes in before they finally choose their investment. Second is to create value. Let me tell you three things they do to create value. Financial engineering. This means what is the method to value these companies like cash flows, capital structure, how to change the debt, management incentive system and so on. Governance engineering. This means how the board and management are structured, what changes to make, recruit senior managers, implementing good governance practices and so on. Operational engineering. This means how to improve the business model, rationalize the cost, increase market share, new products and so on. Third is exit strategy. I would say this is the most important. Entry is always not that difficult, but to exit is. Market dynamics change and the timing is very critical. They must evaluate whether to sell to another private equity or to another industry player or do an IPO, etc. Now that we know that what PE funds do, let me give you the expectations to know if you are a candidate. Number one is effectiveness of business model and competitive position of your company. Number two is how amenable you are for financial governance and operational engineering. Number three is your acceptance to their exit strategy. Remember, not all PE funds make money. Some PE funds even extend their holding period by two years and see even if they can recover their investment. That's the reality. 